Hello guys, this is Honesty Media. In this particular tutorial, we are going to create this beautiful 3D test using your phone. Just use your phone to create huge designs, huge 3D test and those kind of things. Let's simple let's create this simple 3D test on your phone. Just follow me. So let's start something. Just follow me. Follow the steps. You know how to create this beautiful 3D test on honesty media. It is simple on honesty media. Okay now first of all let me delete my my, my oh so that you can start something. Also I'm just deleting this Okay, so we are good to go. Now, first of all, let's go and type in our 2023. For me, I want to use 2023. If you want to use any kind of word that you want to use for your test, so just type in. So if you want to try, just use your numbers. This 2023, there you go. Okay, for now, let's type in the 2023 or our test. Okay, now let's click on the 8 format there. Click on this. Then go and tap on the plus sign there, the text. So you click on this. Then you type in your text. You double. You can double click on the new text or you go to the edit. You click on edit. Then you type in your text. You click on this one and you type in okay so let's go yeah i want to use the 2023 for the 3d test so now just increase it increase it increase it increase it small a bit okay so for me i want to use a particular font for this if you want to use any particular font any font that you want to use for your test you can use it for me. I want to use a test called this. Very good to the font to find that this I'm talking about. So I will use that this font for my test. If I just click on the font, this one font here, then you, you choose this. So I click on this, then I find my font, the font that I want to use, a particular font. So I want to use this font, this here okay so let's click on okay <coughs> click on okay okay so now we are having this now next thing is simple let's go and create the 3d test so look at this one click on the 3d test here then uh you, you enable it just enable it just enable it like this then you are good to go enable it you can see that the test has turned into a 3d test so now for the depth the depth at the back or the depth that you use or that creates the 3d on the test i'm going to i'm going to reduce it because it's too much so the depth i'll use i think i'll use um five five will help me five will help me so let's use that five i want to change the color of the depth so you just click on the, this color, click on this color like this, then you choose your color. For me, I want to use this color. I want to use this color. I want to use this particular color with this one. So you click on it, you can see that it has changed to that color on the depth. Let's use the let's use the blue and see what will happen. Click on the blue like this. You can see that there's blue. For me, I want to use this color this particular color i want to use this color for it so you can choose your color so now let's control something let's go to the x rotation the x rotation like this yes so position it as how you want it so let's go to the right rotation then the right rotation look at how i control my own so just control it let's control it let's control it Okay, so you can see that this half just control. You can just you can use any position for your test. 
or for your 3D test. So for me, I want to use this. Then next, next thing, let's let's mark it. If if done with it, then let's mark it. Let's further we do. Let's go to copy. We are going to copy this test. Now look at this. Click on this copy. And you can see I've copied the test. <coughs> now this one, this second one, we've copied. Let's go to the 3D test and go and reduce the depth. So this depth, you want to use it for something. So let's go and control the depth for a copy test. So we just click on the 3D test. So now let's reduce the depth to 3 or 2. To 3 or 2. Let's use 3. Okay, 3 is okay. Or oh, let's use 2. So 2 is okay like this. Okay, so let's use 3. Let me use 3. 3 is okay for me. Okay, so what I'm going to do next is let's mark it. Then go to colors. We're going to change the color, the white to the color you want use you click on the color choose your color for me i want to use yellow i want to use yellow you click on the yellow you can see that so you can see that i've created this so next thing you're going to do you're about to finish the thing you're about to finish it with this drag it like this and position it on the old one just position on the old one to create a 3d test for you nice 3d test with white in the middle nice 3d test so you just control it you try to control it like this try to control it You can see that we've created a 3D test with white in the middle of the dirt. Now let's create a background for the test. Let's just, let's just create a background. We just go to this. So let's mark this. And go to this one. Click on this one. And go to shapes. So you go to shapes. Then choose, choose your color for your background. I want to use blue. I want to use blue. So I just click on the blue like this and increase it. Just increase it. Just increase it like this. Just increase it. Use, use it to cover the whole place. So into it and cover the whole place like this. Then mark it like this. So marking it click on the or tap on the two here to back you can see here click on the to back like this then after that you can see that your test is on your on board now i want to create a, a, a shadow for the test i want to create a shadow for the 3d test so now let's go to the layers like this click on this layers choose the middle one the 2023 the first one Choose the middle one like this, then remove your layers, then go to go to the A format here, go to the A format here, then go and click on shadow. So go find shadow, click on shadow, click on this shadow, then enable it, just enable it. Let's enable it. You can see that there's shadow under the test. There's shadow under the test. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Thank you for subscribing to Honesty Media. If you are if you are new here, you can subscribe this channel and turn on the notification bell to notify if you drop any video like this to do something for yourself or to work or to design. You can you can design with your phone. If you just click on the subscribe button and you just turn on the notification bell 
you get amazing tutorials to create your flyers, your banners with your phone. It is simple on Honesty Media. Thank you for watching this video.